well, after the movie came out, I was uh, a world tour um, DJ for uh, Tyler or whatever. I'm his DJ. So we did uh, America, Australia. We did like the UK and Europe and all that stuff. And that was a blast. Tour is always fun. So, so when you're on tour with Tyler, it's just straight arena rock. I huh? like. Yeah. This, get, um, my bad, I didn't mean to cut you off. Go ahead. I, I'm, I'm awful. Yeah, this Here's tour was, um, our arenas. You smack the, uh, smack the mic. You know, as his career gets higher, the, um, arenas get bigger. And it's pretty crazy. The shows are like, he's an amazing performer, he's really good. A lot of the rap people don't know how to perform that well nowadays. They just like kind of play the track and like dance on stage. But like he performs as like an actual performer for real. So that's always cool to see the homies do their thing. How many shows did you guys do on the world tour? That's a good question because I don't be paying attention. Um, <laughs> it, was, it was a nice amount. It was for sure like, I was going to guess in between 40 and 60. Oh shit. Because it was like we hit like all the like popular states in California, I mean, like California and America, and all the cooler places in Europe. And then we did uh, uh, both of the coasts of Australia. And then we never made it back to Japan. I thought we was going back to Japan this tour, but I guess that didn't happen. But maybe next time. Do you have a favorite place? Um, like in the States or out of States? Out of States. Out of States, it's hard to just pick one, but I can name like a couple places I love to go. I like London a lot. I like Copenhagen. Mm -hmm. um, Japan was really, really cool. Honestly, everywhere. I love Australia. Great times out there. I can't even say, like, it's nowhere I've really been. I, like, hate it. But I got a question. When you're touring with Tyler, um, is it with the whole Odd Future as a collective? Or is Odd Future still a thing? Um, or is it just Tyler? It's just him. Yeah. It's him. Well, at first it was, um, I was just hype man. Mm -hmm. Travis Taco was DJ and he would perform. But then Travis started doing more stuff with, um, with movies and television and stuff like that. So then I started becoming a DJ. So now it's just me and him on tour. Plus, you know, all the production and all that yeah. stuff. But yeah. Sweet. And uh, just straight arena rocking. Yeah. How old are you? 32. All right. So like, I don't really care to go out. I'd rather drink at home if I do drink. But I don't ever drink like that no more. I like to relax. I'm a so, relaxer. And I, and I'm like 32. Is that higher or lower than your body count? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that's a good question. <laughs> I'm going to say my, my body count for sure is higher than that. <laughs> I was a wild man in the first tours. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Oh, man. Oh, I can only I, imagine. When I first yeah. tested the uh, the groupie thing, that was crazy. I was like, I see, I, I literally tested it. It was a girl. <laughs> she wanted to get on the tour, tour bus and take photos. And I was like, you want to come on the bus? Like, what's up? And she was like, I'll suck your dick. And I was like, let's see what happens. And I was like, is that easy? Then tour became a fucking, you know, a party. Man, that's <laughs> yeah. crazy. It's dangerous, though. You never know. That's crazy. Like, uh, it did, how, how long did that, like, kind of a, a vibe? Because you just seem like just such a chill dude. Like, you're not really. Um, I was a wild man for a while. I was like the first, like, seven years of a... Uh, the uh, the fame, whatever you want to call it, of being noticed by the world, I would say. I don't like to use the word famous because I don't feel like I'm really famous. I'm just a, a young black man living a, a nice life. Yeah, I think that's that's fair to say. Like, uh, I, I I think I don't like to use the word famous too yeah, much because like, I don't think I'm that big of a like deal. Like, LeBron James is famous. Right. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I'm right. Jasper. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. like, How are you guys neither. touring around uh, on a bus or taking PJs? Um, in America, it's on a bus, and then uh, it was PJs and regular flights in Europe. I usually, uh, we'll stay, like, for instance, like, we'll stay in London for a little while and then fly to the other parts and do yeah. shows and then come back and, like, that'll be our hub, like, our stay spot. That's cool. Yeah. You guys sell a ton of merch at your shows? Yeah, the merch do go crazy. What's like, on I, your... I'm adding my merch in there a little bit. That's good. good. Yeah, and, and before when... we take it over next time. And, and is that Jasper Dolphin merch at the uh, shows? No, it's uh, it's, the call. brand is called Last Call. I started it a while ago. It's not like Jasper Dolphin, but it's just different cool designs. Mm -hmm. and, and 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 when you're on tour, like you're you're just raking in money. Huh? I mean, those shows are huge. Yeah, yeah, straight work. It's it's a it's good work because it's like it's not too hard. It's fun. I'm there with my friends. Like security guards, like one of my good friends too. We love Ville. He's the greatest security guard. He might look scary, but he's a nice man. All right. <laughs> it was all, it's all fun. Fun and games. And you guys travel on one bus, you and Tyler? Um, this recent tour, yeah, it was just me and him on the bus. 
And then I think we had a couple of buses because the tours are like, you know, the production is everything way bigger than it used to be. So it felt weird. It was just me and him on the bus. Usually it'd be like me, him, one of the other homies, somebody that records like video and like security. But security got his own bus now with some other people. So it was different. It was cool. Crazy, man. Do you like shopping on Amazon? I do. And good news is Steve-O's butt wipes for your butthole are available on Amazon. And if you want a real bundle of a deal, you can get Steve-O's hot sauce for your butthole, plus Steve-O's butthole destroyer, and Steve-O's butt wipes for your butthole. It's the butthole bundle available on Amazon right now. Yeah, dude.